Alright, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to our Pokemon Platinum Randomized Nuzlocke. Last time we left off, uh, we beat the gym. We got our new badge. Uh, as you notice, uh, there has been a team change again. And I'm gonna feel like we might just be doing that a lot because uh, I decided to go ahead and mess around. We got Alloy. Uh, didn't take long, actually, surprisingly. Up to level 44, and then we met a Bastiodon who gave us a bunch of XP because we killed it. Uh, Alloy should, or Aloy, let me phrase, sorry about that. Aloy should evolve at level 45 and we get Metagross. And then Ethiopian, who I completely forgot that we even had a Rhyhorn until last episode, really, uh, evolves at level 42 to ride on. And then we also have a Protector uh, somewhere in this mess. I think it's at the very top. Yeah, it was, we found it super early on. Uh, so early on, it's the second item in our bag. So we can use that, and we can evolve Rhydon into Rhyperior. Still has a four times weakness. Actually, two dual four times weaknesses, water and grass. Uh, so we got to be super careful on that. Other things may arise as well. Ice is going to be a problem. Fighting will be a problem. Rhyperior just is sick all around. But unfortunately for Nuzlocke, uh, it has a lot of weaknesses. Uh, with that being said, let's go ahead and continue on with the story. I went ahead and ran all the way over here. Oh, can I heal up right here? Actually, I think I'm full health, but I'm already committed to it. Anyway. So we'll go ahead and finish that out. Uh, go through here. I believe this is the lake it told us to go to in the last episode. Um... I still don't know how to get to these items. It doesn't make any sense. There's trees in the way. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I am a. Uh, I think we should be able to enter the lake now. Yes, we can. Wait, can I get an encounter here? Because there's Lake Valor, and this is Lake Valor. Valor Lake Front. And then this is just Lake Valor. So, technically, if I can figure out a way to get a Pokemon here, we get one. Oh, see, this is the area. I knew it. This is the area that has all the Magikarps. Yeah, we... Oh. What is going on right now? The game is, like, slowing down. Holy crap. Ha. Uh, can I fight you, bro? Hicket Twinley. Oh, the one next to... It. Okay. So we gotta go all the way home. Flopping around the mud? Not really. Dude, what if they all evolved into Gyarados and just destroyed you? You'd feel bad. Oh, why do you have a bowl cut, too? It looks so weird. <gasps> Swallow! That's what it's called. Not Swallow, Swallow. Man, I couldn't remember. Was that like two, three episodes ago? I couldn't remember for the life of me what his actual name was. All right, we'll go ahead and take you down. We have the same amount of health. Endeavor's not going to do much. Wow, Endeavor actually did a lot. Why is that? Good lord. At least I always hit twice. And this should mean that Ethiopian levels up. Nice. Ooh. Oh, I got sneeze. <laughs> Woo. Oh, man. Whoa. Alright, we need someone who can tank these shots. Who do we send in? Uh, does Terror? I didn't give an ice type move. Actually, I don't think any of them have an ice type move now. I'm thinking about it. Oh wait, Ethiopian has. Hold on, I'm gonna heal real quick. Kind of feel out what he's doing here. I believe I put Dragon Pulse uh, instead of having Stomp on uh, my Rhyhorn here. So that should be super effective. Slash, that should be ineffective. Oh, as a crit, I was like, wow, that actually did slightly more than I thought it'd be. This should be super effective. I don't know how much Dragon Claw will do. It does a decent amount. But I think we should survive at least two more of those. And if we can take him out with Dragon Pulse, then we're good. Nice. Wait, he missed me on the last one? Why is he doubling to Slash? Wow, he crit on Slash again. Oh my gosh. This guy's nutty. And see you later. Smell you later. 
Dang, that XP though. 1600 for Garchomp. <gasps> what? I'm not gonna dance like an idiot the whole time. I really could, but I'm not going to. Burn. Woo! We got right on. Look at him go. Ooh, we learned Hammer Arm. That must be an evolution move. Okay. Uh, it lowers the user speed. Well, you already have super low speed anyway. So, what does that matter? Uh, I think for the time being, maybe I do get rid of Dragon Pulse. Actually, I think that's the one I could rebuy. So, we'll get rid of Dragon Pulse. I'm not going to get rid of Takedown because he has Rock Head. Uh, so, he doesn't take recoil damage of any kind. We got Hammer Arm. Nice. Uh, that does mean now we can give the Protector to Ethiopian here. And now, whenever they level up... Oh, I have a rare candy. Mmm, <gasps> that's tempting. But we just got 1600 XP on him. Uh, I feel like I might save it for something else. I don't know what. Well, how much XP does uh, Aloy have? Oh, you're not too far off either. Okay, yeah, that's right. That Bastiodon, I forgot about that. Um, is there any items around here? I feel like there would be. Oh, the frames. Blech. Can we catch one of these boys? Can we get a static encounter from these? I would love to be able to. Actually, I think... Uh, can we... I think we're just gonna keep fighting people here. Uh, try and get... The Blast Force was phenomenal! Poor Magic Harps. Uh, try and level up both a soul rock. I don't really. Oh wait, I just got hammer arm. Hold up. Ooh. You know what? Even if my speed falls, I'm totally fine with that. Can't use items. Does that mean I just can't like heal? Maybe I can still swap out though. Dude, that's awesome. We're keeping that one. Nice fighting type move. So we're going to try and level up Ethiopian again. Now that it has Protector on. And then we're going to try and uh, level up Aloy. So we can get Metagross. And our team just becomes yoked. Uh, jacked, if you will. If you don't understand what yoked means. Oh, there's a cave. Oh, is that really how soon you can get to the cave? Wait. There's grass up there. Oh, that means I can get an encounter here. But wait, has it? That means there has to be water in the lake, though, right? How the fudge? How the fudge are we getting water back in the lake? I'm so confused. Okay, I'm gonna go fight this other dude that was right here. You. Oh, actually, you know what? There was a second set of steps that went the opposite direction, right? We need to go back and do that one as well. Oh, he has four. Oh, we ran into a mini boss. I'll take that back. We're not into a mini boss. Oh, wait. Electrovire can no low kick. I don't think any of the rest of my Pokemon here have... Uh, this might be... I think I'm sending Terror. Because if he knows a low kick, which, uh, for those who don't know, is a fighting type move that does more based on how much your, your uh, Pokemon weighs. So, heavy Pokemon, like Snorlax, Rhydon, all those, uh, it's technically just a direct counter. Will Shadow Punch do more? I I don't know. This shouldn't do too much. Terror is now beefy in defense. Oh, yeah. Terror is good. Dusclops is just, just double-cheeked up. Oh, yeah. We good. Oh, he has Thunder Punch. I didn't know that. I have a higher standard of defense, though, I believe. Oh, he paralyzed me. Boo. What? I disagree. I disagree. 
100%. Ouch. Oh, it was a crit. I was like, wow. Wow. That did a lot. Hmm. Yes. Houndor. Well, brother. Tell you right now. I'm probably gonna swap act actually, I'm gonna swap back into Ethiopian on this one. Oh my god, I just realized Ethiopian has 168 XP. That's so much. Actually, I haven't looked at Ethiopian stats. Oh man. I like a bubble in my throat there, that's weird. Uh honestly I might just take down. That should do a lot. Strength does a lot too. But I think takedown actually does more. And it was a crit. And I don't take recoil damage because of Rockhead. Another? Are you kidding me? Oh, I can't even swap out a tear. I mean, I can swap into Aloy. Oh, wait. I just realized that Garchomp. I do have... Doesn't our Blast always know something that's ice? I forget. Or did I refuse to teach him something that's ice? I think I was going to teach him Ice Beam, but I don't think I did. Go, Aloy. Man, Aloy can still hit, though, like a truck. Yeah, do that ten more times. We'll be good. Altaria, part dragon. Uh, it's kind of risky to do outrage, but I think we're safe. Yeah, we're good. Because it should be super effective, and it's 120 base. So, this should rather one hit or two hit. And I don't think Altaria will have anything that will be able to two hit us. Oh. Pff. Easy. Easy clap. 1300. There we go. Yeah, you took the punishment, bro. Uh, need... Give him some milk. Get his health up. There we go. And then, where's the cookies? He needs a cookie. Cookies and milk. There you go. Proven fact. Cookies and milk will heal you. Um, tested. Field tested, even. Who to thunk? Uh, Wait, can I get back here? Is there a point where these Magikarp go? Well, I guess the rocks are still going to be there. Worthless, all of them. Dude, that's when they come back as Gyarados and they just wreck you. Uh, so I do have one more fight over yonder way. Come here, boy. Oh, we get to do the... Yeah, we get to do that after, right? Oh, this dude looks like a boss fight. I don't think any of our Pokemon need anything. We should be fine. Uh, can I just run around? I like how it makes like a symbol in the water. Oh, is there any like items in here? I kind of want to know. Is there an item in here? I want to know. Can you show me all the items that I cannot see? Wow, okay. There's literally nothing. I guess there's supposed to be a fight. Okay. The mission is proceeding with the boss should be pleased. Everything is for everyone and the good of Team Galactic. My voice mind you later. No! I recognize your face. You're the child who raided the team building. Wait, a second raided the team Galactic building in Eterna. Huh? Jupiter should be ashamed of herself being beaten by a child, but anything and anyone that opposes Team Galactic must be crushed. Even the very thought of opposition must not be tolerated. Wow, I can't believe that dude had a voice modulator on. He's just talking with the hair, though. Just the whoosh. He's like, I'm a wolf. Ah. Uh, yep. Nope. Not dealing with another times four weakness. Screw that. I don't care what you have. Hop it or not. 38. Holy crud. I'm just not realizing if this dude has an ace, it's probably going to be at least level 40, 41. Uh, get out of here, bro. If anything, he'll send out a water type or a ground type. So, uh, depending on what he sends out next, we'll probably be able to figure out the rest of his team. 
Lotad. Somewhere between can't send back out our uh, other dude. Uh, but did, 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 what's your weakness again? Ice type, right? Did I give Justy? I don't remember if I gave him an ice move or not. I don't think he does. Now that I'm thinking about it. I really should give him ice beam. That would make sense. Okay, I did. I still have Skull Bash on him. That's the problem. Uh, for the time being, we'll just surf him because he already decided to. Oh, that's a t that's a one quarter of damage, isn't it? Oh, oh, it was a crit. I was like, dang, dang. Oh, uh, I forgot. Mega Drain's base forty though, so we should be fine. Holy crap! Justy going in. My Lanta. We can eat those. Ooh, man, Jesse is just a tank. Alright, now I have a good arena for me to fight in. Didn't you already have a hoppip? You had two hoppips? What are the actual odds of that? I'm very confused. Go, Kogan. Flame wheel, go! Uh, this may not actually kill. Maybe two times. May have a load defense, but with rain going. Yeah. So I figured that would have stopped it even just the slightest bit. I think it takes, uh, what is it? 25%? I think it reduces it by 25%. Does Lava Plume still hit? Wow, that did quite a bit, actually. I think uh, rain reduces fire. Just fire damage? I think just fire damage by 25%. As a kid, I thought it was 50%, but uh, in reality, I just sucked at about knowing Pokemon because I didn't know there was a difference between special attack and special uh, regular attack. Get three legendary Pokemon to the lakes. Should have captured. Wouldn't it, if he caught it, wouldn't he technically be the owner then? Because I mean, that is fair game then. These are all like facing up. That's weird. All right, so now we have to go to the other lake, right? Uh, what's it called? You know, Lake. What's it called? Um, man, I can't remember for the life of me. Not Verity. The one next to our hometown. I'm not going to remember it. Unfortunately, I suck. So, uh, I'll probably just go ahead and clip forward to whenever we're right outside that. Uh, so, you guys don't have to watch me run all the way back. That makes absolutely no sense anyway. So, uh, I will see you guys in like 0.1 seconds. But for me, it'll be a little bit longer. So, I will see you then. Hey! Glad you guys can make it. Look at that. Time truly does fly. In the meantime, I went ahead and also taught Ice Beam to our Justy here, Blastoise. Uh, I, it was a good idea to do. I went ahead and did that. So, uh, anyway, not, nothing else changed. Had to get all the way here. Oh, hello. Oh, Drake, what timing. Those Team Galactic Scoundrels are after the listener Pokemon. You gotta help them down. Hey, dude. Oh, I was running this whole time. What, did he just... Oh, I was like, did he destroy both of them? Because that'd be really funny. Do I get a double battle here? Well, at least they're honest. They're, you know... If they're just trying to stall me, at least they're honest. Um, which really means they know they're not going to succeed. Why does one have three and the other one have one? What the heck? Ethiopian and alloy. Uh, crud. Uh, grass and ice... Yeah, I can't keep you in. Uh, grass, fire. I'm going to swap in terror for you. Are you poison too? Either way, I'm going to get rid of Sneasel. Sneasel can have dark type moves. And it's going to be effective on terror. Oh! The other ones are only 33. 
That would have actually hurt a little bit, but that shouldn't be too hurt. Too much painful for the other ones. Burn, little demon rabbit. Nice. All right. Are you poison type? I don't remember if Swallow is poison or not. I don't think it is. I mean, I'll fire punch you real quick and then flamethrower you at the same time. If you don't die, which I think you will. The chances of it not dying are actually very slim. Wow. Does this thing just have really beefy special defense? It's just beefy spe just defense in general. Holy crap, I didn't know that. Oh, and you're stuck in an encore, which is going to last, what, four rounds? Five rounds? It's one of those two numbers. And he's hitting Amnesia, but it's not going to do him any good now. Oh, special defense rose sharply. What? It's not like acupressure, at least. It just raises a random stat. Alright. Meganium. Why did you send out Meganium? What is your last Pokemon type then? I mean, either way, I'm going to go ahead and use Cookie on Terror. Cookie, Cookie, Cookie. Uh, oh, I'm still stuck in that. Ooh. This might hurt. Never mind, I take that back. This will hurt for you. Hopefully. Hopefully. Yes, okay. Uh, I kind of want to swap in. I don't think... Will it go for Terror? I highly doubt it. You know what? I'm not going to even risk it. It's not worth the bit. Because that times four weakness is just a butt. Ugh, when your times four to... Two different things. You know for what I just said today. Nice. Actually, that does give us more XP for Aloy. <gasps> Ooh. We getting a Metagross. Yeah, no one's there, bro. Rylau, another one that we're weak to. Uh, is Ghost super effective on... I'm gonna find that out. I don't know if Ghost is super effective on fighting types or not. Oh, dear God, no. Please, no. Die. Okay, I just realized. Rylau, I'm pretty sure, still can learn Counter. At, like, level 20. And I just hit it with Aloy. Mean look? What does Mean look even do? Target becomes unable to flee? I mean, that'd be useful for, like, a Pokemon that would run away, but I have Master Balls if, it was that came, if I was that worried about it. So, I don't need that. Losing is part of my job, too. You feel better by saying that. Really, it just means you suck. <gasps> oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Here we go, boys. Oh. We get Metagross. Oh, yeah. Aloy is now Miss Aloy. That's right. She's beefy. You don't want to mess with her. Oh, wait. What? You can learn Hammer Arm, too? I mean, might as well. What would we get rid of, though, unfortunately? Uh... It would have to be flamethrower, I think. But I don't know if I'd want to get rid of the fire typing, because that's pretty good coverage. Metal Claw, ironically enough, until I learn a better move, Metal Claw is actually kind of bust. Because it only does 50 damage. Hammer Arm does 100. It does twice the amount of damage. And it's not even 100% accuracy. Are you kidding me? What the? Yeah, I'm going to get rid of Metal Claw. It 
ironically enough, Steel Psychic doesn't have any Steel type moves. Steel isn't really super effective on. Is Steel super effective on anything at this point in time? I don't think it is. I think it's just Stab. Is Steel super effective against Rock? I think that's it, but I have Water type, Ice, and Fighting now. All super effective on it. That's kind of strange now that I'm thinking about it. Oh, let me just. Let me look at her. Oh my gosh, she got a lot of extra XP, actually. She gained like 15 extra XP? That's not bad. I'll take that. Clear body. Uh, defense boosted a lot. Oh my gosh. That physical attack, though. 142. Dude, pseudo legendaries are just complete nutty. And that's what this is. What item did I give you, by the way? Razor Fang. Oh, that's right. Uh, do you actually know... How many of your moves are actually physical? Special, special, physical, physical. So only these two are honestly the only two that are physical. And I don't think I have any physical TMs. Do I have any physical TMs for Confirm? Thunder's not, Flamethrower's not, Manitite. No, 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 no. Submission... I mean, that one technically is, but I wouldn't want to use it. Rolling Kick. Uh, it's kind of weak. Mega Kick. Kind of the same thing. Outrage. You already have that. Horn Attack. It's not going to be worth it, though. I mean, those Bug Buzz is special, though. It's not physical. So, really, you're pure physical. Uh, what is Ethiopian? Ethiopian, very heavy physical. Uh, both attack and regular defense. Special is butts. Oh my lord. Well, we do have a second tanky boy, though. Uh, but Terror still racking in with 129 and 135. Aloy only just above that in regular defense. But my lord. Oh wait, Coogan's a special defense. Or special attack. Hold on. I didn't know that. Coogan. You need flamethrower instead of uh, fire. Oh, the other one. Uh, yeah. Although I feel like you should have learned it by now. Instead of flame wheel, yeah. Lava plume. Yeah, that's. I'm not going to get rid of lava plume. I mean, you don't really need a physical attack. Well, you know what? I'll get rid of smoke screen for the time being. I think that might be a better option. Didn't even realize that till just now. Man, we just got some beefy Pokemon. It's it feels good. It feels right. Next fight. Here we go. Give it to me. Oh, the water level's risen. That means we can surf. Ooh. I mean, we've already lost out on the Latias encounter that was here in the very beginning. <gasps> Slugma. <gasps> Slugma. I'm not going to finish that sentence. It'd be a funny joke, though, wouldn't it? Oh, okay. I know Metagross is sick. But the one weird, like, little arm just sticking up kind of kills it just a hair. Uh, Gastrodon, will you have anything? You're bug water, right? I mean, if I hammer arm Gastrodon and then Psychic Gastrodon, we should be fine. Because Slugma's only level 34, Aloy's 45, he's 11 levels lower, and I don't think he has Flamethrower or anything. So, if we get rid of one, I think we're good. Oh, shoot. And we're getting Rhyperior after this fight. Oh, he's getting hard, bro. He's getting hard. That sounds weird. Dude. Okay, you know what? I just gotta swap this. Uh, you are in a very losing fight. Uh, I say Justy... 
I'm not gonna lie, swapping into our two starters sounds like the better option here. But I still think that Aloy can take him. If it didn't have such high defenses, I would be worried. And that, oh, it's a, your physical attacker, no special. But look at the special attack still going in. Although you do get stab on it, so that's good. Which one did you pull from? I'm assuming Blastoise. Yeah. Blastoise having heavy defense as well. Kaferi? What is it? Oh, that might be your last Pokemon then. Never mind. Uh, I am going to Ice Beam Badoo. You can Hammer Arm Clefairy. Because it should be a normal type. And with that super high... Yeah, oh my god, this is... Its health is going to go down super fast. 169, wow, you guys give me like no XP, what the heck. I'll take it. I'll take it. A little lost of speed. I'm already slower than them anyway. Well, slower by default. Oh, shoot. The triple Evos? Got Rhyperior. That's dope. Uh, now the real question is, what are your stats now? Oh my gosh, we gained more health. Holy crap. <whistles> Dang. Powers down super effective moves? <gasps> oh, I didn't know that. Wait. Does that... Is that the one where it reduces all super effective moves by like 25%? Hold on. Solid rock ability. Uh, reduces damage from super effective moves by 25% regardless of effectiveness of any multiplier. Dude. And there's actually only four Pokemon have it. And it's Tortuga, then the Corcosta, the... That's Generation 7? 6? I think 7. And then Camera Up and Rhyperior. Those are the only ones who have that ability. And then I'm pretty sure... What's my hidden ability? Oh, and increases the power moves that have recoil damage. But that means... Does that mean I also... Do I, do I lose my rock head then? So that means I just take more damage from recoil. Actually, I, know I take recoil damage in general now. Uh, either way, that's pretty dope. Uh, so that means... I think rock... Is Rock Blast physical? Yes, it is. So that one should actually do... That's 25. Plus my attack boost. Which is 142. Plus it's stab. So technically, Rock Blast should be doing a base... Like 40, 43... Every time. Per hit. Which is gonna be completely dope. That's gonna be awesome. Uh, I need to heal up. Uh, I've actually never had Rhyperior. I think I said it a long time ago, and that's pretty... And I'm pretty happy about it. It feels good. Uh, especially since we know he has that now. Oh, wait, that's right. Uh, now we can also give him a different item. Actually, if I give him... Do I still have that rock one? The Earth... Earth, that's ground type. Where's the rock one? We have one that does rock. What's it called? Stone plate? We have the stone plate, but that one does... I don't think that one does it as much as the rock incense, I think is what we had. Where the heck's it at? Bright, splash plate, leftover skull fossil. 
Where the fudge it at? Did I pass it? I might have passed it. This is why I prefer if they could organize it somehow. Oh my gosh. Where's it at? Rock incense. There it is. Uh, powers up rock type moves. Give that to Ethiopian. So now, rock blast should be broken. Uh, and by should be, it is broken now. Because now it's going to be a 2 to 5 hit on a Pokemon that already boosts it with a high standard attack. Uh, it's going to be great. That face, it brings back bad memories. A whole lot of trouble that is. Look at your face. You remember me, don't you? Fine, tell you. I don't know if I can more to you. What is it? You need the same. Look at the Pokemon. You're not a chance. You're not even a teeny one. Not all going down. Oh, she's fighting me? Did she just fight Dawn? Is she fighting me and Dawn? No, she's just fighting me. Dawn, what are you doing here then? Kecleon. Oh no. Kecleon, what shall we do? Oh, dude, that that roar though. He's lying. Okay, well that's. <laughs> dude. You should be scared. This is one hit on a base normal damage. Wait, that made it to a rock type? One hit changes it to a rock type mid attack. Good thing rock type is also uh, one to one. Dang boy. Whoo! Ethiopian is correct. I'm running away. Uh, someone who knows something electric, get out there. Uh, go terror. Oh, she has level forties. Oh no. Oh no! Screech! Ah! Although I guess technically we have the badge now that lets us last all the way until what? Level 70? Yeah, Water Pulse would have hurt us by a lot. Wait, I just realized that you used Screech before it did that when we swapped. That's a little strange. No. Ooh, almost said it again. I need to try to not say that so much. Water Pulse, go! Man, if, the only problem with Terror is that his health is just complete butts. Defense stat, special defense, fantastic. Regular health sucks. I don't know why. You feel like if it's that bulky of a Pokemon. Oh my lord. Come on, Terror. Oh my gosh, Terror. <gasps> Oh, God. Terror. What are you doing? This is this a joke to you? Heal up, bro. Hey, need some milk. Milk and cookies. Thank you. Man, I have bought so many Moo Milks, especially for training Pokemon. Holy crap. Dude. I guess we're using more milk. Thank you. Lord, we have a lot of them. What the heck? I mean, he's probably gonna use Water Pulse again. But at least now, if even if he crits, we should be able to survive it. Okay, we're good. Nope, I don't need to use another one of those. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to do that. Oh, he's still faster than us. I forgot about that, too. I mean, I guess technically at this point in time, he... Can I just swap into someone else at this point in time? Who would I swap into? Aloy? Nah, Justy. Tox. Nah, Justy. Uh, Terror's just getting wrecked because he's confused. He's confused, but he's got the right mentality. Don't worry. Not very effective. Great. Oh, wait, you're not Psychic type, though. I always confuse that. Although, I can learn Psychic and Side Beam. Gold Lick is not Psychic type. Very strange. Very strange. Bruh. Uh, I think Entei actually has a higher... I think she has a pretty decent defense. So, Special Defense is probably the weakest. Although, they could be pretty equal on grounds. I don't know what they would be. Wow, that actually did 
I thought it'd probably do a little bit less, so I'm I'm pretty content with that result right there. Uh, I'm gonna have to heal the team after this though, because uh, for some reason we're taking damage out in the butts. First wind works, yeah. Wait, how? You said you tr you got them to the HQ. I'm so confused. Keith was having Lake Acuity. Is Keith safe? I don't know. Where's Lake Acuity? What? Well, he says something about Snowpoint City, right? On the last episode, we were in the library, or something like that. Snow, snow. I think Snowpoint sounds correct, though. Uh, we're going to heal. I don't know where that's at. Or maybe there's... Was there a location I was at before where I couldn't get through because I needed strength or something? Oh, Mount Coronet. I forgot about that. Yeah, there's the caving right there. I think you can use uh, other stuff, too. Oh, look at that. Wait, hold on. There's There's got to be more over here, right? I'm pretty convinced that there's... <gasps> there's more grass over here. We could have saved an encounter for a long time, but we can't now. Oh, we could have Golbat. See, we could have caught Golbat. Super early on, could have got Golbat, but no. How's that feel? Grudge? Honestly, I don't think I've even heard of Grudge before. I, I can't even place it in my mind. If the user faints, the user grudge fully to place the PP foes move that knocked it out. What? Oh god, no, that's we don't want that. Oh, there's different counters over here too. What the heck? Who to thunk? Cobble tops, that'd be kinda of dope to have. Well, I kinda of just want to find out if there's any more items. Wow. Barely running through the grass here. Hold on, uh, yep, yep, okay. Okay, I just want to use my dowsing machine real fast. I'm assuming there's one platform here. There's probably a platform on the other side too, right? It only makes sense. No? Is there really only the one? Oh, here's what the water encounter could have been. What are the odds that the Pokemon we find on the water is also the Pokemon we found in the grass? Oh, I'm just going to be salty. I just kind of wish... Uh, so there is one rule in a Nuzlocke that you're allowed to break. And that's dual catching a Pokemon. Or at least getting a double encounter in an area. Uh, because you find a Shiny. And it's the Shiny Claws. Pretty well, if you find a shiny Pokemon, you're allowed to use it. Get out of here. I know he's gonna be he's gonna be faster than me no matter what, too. Oh my Lanta. Dude, let me out. Let me out! There we go. Yeah, if we find a shiny Pokemon though, we can actually use it. Uh that's fair game. Unfortunately, that's the only way it's fair game. Yes, I'm pretty sure that uh, this location, you don't find the legendaries until after... Is it after the storyline completes and you take on the Elite Four, or after even the Elite Four? I think it might be after the Elite Four. I'm pretty sure that like the Pokemon sits like right here, or something like that. Yeah, even have the legendary music going already. <laughs> Wait, they're at the water's edge now. What the heck? 
Oh my lord, let me go. Let me go. They like move, that's weird. Alright, well, I guess we'll be out of here. Oh man, I guess I could use. I have that fossil token. Get one more encounter somewhere. Although I kind of want to do it somewhere where I haven't seen everything already. Um, good lord, Shuckle, get away. And look at Tongue. Dude, the one time we find a legendary that's dope like that. Still can't believe it was my first encounter in this entire Nuzlocke. Alright, so now we have to head to Lake Acuity. Where, where the heck's that at? It's not over here, is it? Fight area? 229, 230 resort area. I mean, there's Stark Mount. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6... Seven, eight, eight encounters just in that one little snippet right there. Then Snow Point, the Cutie Lake Front, and then the lake itself. So there's three, four, five, and then Mount Coordinate. So yeah. So we have uh, pretty well five more encounters up here and then eight over here. Uh, so yeah, that's where we'll be for that. Yeah. And I guess, uh, technically, with that, we will end the episode right there. Hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you guys in the next one. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you want to be named after a Pokemon, or just if you're enjoying the walk in general, or you have a problem with one of the things I've done in the past, especially with, like, fossils and stuff. Let me know, because then we'll have to work that in some way. Uh, in the meantime, have yourself a fantastic day. I will see you guys in the next one. Farewell. Farewell.